Disney definitely in focus for today's tech check with a crackdown on password sharing. One of the many headlines from those strong earnings. Julia Borston has more on the quarter. Hey, Julia. Well, Carl, Bob Iger laid out a new plan to make streaming a key growth driver for Disney. And part of that streaming plan includes a new focus on ad-supported streaming. Iger announcing that Disney Plus with ads now has 3.3 million subscribers. He also announced price hikes of the ad-free versions of Hulu and Disney Plus to drive consumers to adopt the dual revenue ad-supported versions. Now, Disney's raising prices on ad-free Disney Plus to $14 from 11 and Hulu to 18 from $15. While ad-supported Disney Plus and Hulu Plus, those prices are going to stay unchanged. He's also talking about cracking down on password sharing as yet another way to make money from streaming. Iger saying they have the tools in place and also a plan to roll out tactics to drive monetization of account sharing next year. Iger acknowledging that he's taking a page from Netflix and also praising Netflix's strategy. Take a listen. Our streaming business is still actually very young. In fact, it's not even four years old. Um, it launched in November of 2019. Um, and we love, we love to have the margins that Netflix has. They've accomplished those margins, though, over a substantially longer period of time. And they've done so because they figured out how to really carefully balance their investment in programming uh, with their pricing strategy. Yeah, as Iger thinks about balancing investment with pricing, Bernstein today writing that Disney's D2C segment should hit break even quickly once the second set of price increases hits these streaming options. Carl?